Magandang gabi mga kapamilya. It is day number three. Maulan sa labas dito sa ating uh, Volleyball Central or the Phil Oil Flying V Center kung saan po at uh, uh, nagaganap ang uh, Philippine and uh, the Premier Volleyball League and ang Open Conference day number three as we get ready for match number six. Kanina po for match number five, nanalo ang Lady Warriors contra Perlas Spikers which leads us to our second game of our Wednesday doubleheader. And a lot of people excited dito sa labanan, the Water Defenders and the Cool Smashers live on SNA and of course on PremierVolleyballLeague.com and on your number one sports website here in the Philippines. Hello for ABS-CBN Sports, I'm Boone Gonzalez together with Mosey Rivera and of course Janine Joy, ang ating panel at large for this live and exclusive coverage. Masayang masaya kami at uh, nanonood kayo. Sana safe kayo no? dahil medyo malakas yung ulan sa labas. And Janine, simulan na natin napakaganda ng ating laban ngayon dalawang nanalo ng opening day. Tama ka dyan, Boom. Boom and Mosey, at day 3 of the Open Conference at ngayong araw maghaharap ang dalawang kupunan gaya nga ng sinabi mo na nag-open ang ating Open Conference with back back wins. Puntahan muna natin ang kupunan ng Water Defenders kung saan nagugi sila kontra ang Power Smashers after a thrilling five-set match. Ang Cool Smashers naman nagwagi din kontra ang Adamson Lady Falcons after surviving four sets. And uh, Mosey, both were very impressive. Regardless of five sets, four sets, there were impressive wins para dun sa dalawang kupunan. That's right. And uh, actually nga, no, nung naglaro na yung mga teams natin, na-realize natin, eto na naman tayo. Sure. Ang kaganda na naman ng matchups natin this conference. At maaari nga, may mga nags sabi pa, Mosey at Janina, pwede rin itong mga, of course, contenders, itong uh, water defenders uh, at ang kanilang mga kalaban ngayon, ang uh, cream line, creamy ice cream. Yan. Tama ka dyan, Boom. May mga nagdagdag, may mga nabawas. Kaya naman mga kapamilya, kilalanan pa natin ang isa sa mga crowd favorites. Ang cream line, oh. Sige, babalikan oh. natin yan, Janine. Titignan muna natin ang ating team standings. Dahil, uh, dahil nga day number three, no, Mosey? Yes. Tingnan natin kung nasa ng kalagayan nito mga kupunan na ito. Alam mo, Boom, ah, kakapanalo na naman ang ating Lady Warriors. So, 2-0 na sila at siya yung nasa ibabaw ng ating standings as you can see right here. Ang Cool Smashers, nakakaisang laro pa lamang at napanggit nyo nga panalo, pati ang Water Defenders. So, nasa simula pa lang tayo ng ating exciting na conference. So, Ang uh, mananalo today, aakyat yan kasama ng Lady Warriors. Of course, both of them wanting to do that right now. Right. An impressive win earlier by the Lady Warriors. At uh, gusto silang samahan ng either the Cool sm Smashers or the Water Defenders. All right, now, punta natin yung sinasabi ni Janine. Kasi kami, lahat kami excited lagi oh. sa mga team profile. Eh, dahil gusto natin kilalanin itong mga teams natin dito sa PBL. Kagaya nga na sinabi ko kanina, Boom. Isa sa mga crowd favorites, ang Creamline Cool Smashers. May mga nadadbag, may mga nabawa. Kaya naman kilalanin natin ang bagong lineup na lahat this conference. After wrapping up her collegiate career sa UAAP, bagong kabanata ang haharapin ngayon ng former Lady Eagle na si Julia Morado. She might have traded her blue jersey for hot pink, pero kakaibang excitement naman ang hatid nito sa kanyang mga fans. Lalo na't makakasama muli ni Gia ang kanyang dating teammate sa Ateneo na si Eliza Valdez. I'm really happy na ma makakalaro ko ulit si Atelay. Aninina si Atelay lahat ng 
mga napapanood ko sa ibang league, sa ibang team. Siyempre, new experience nito, so it's really exciting for me. Super excited to play with her again kasi halos three years din kami together. Analo kami, natalo. We're, we were together. So, I'm just really excited na may kasama ako na parehas kami ng pinagdaanan. A stronger and tougher lineup ng Cool Smashers ang aabangan sa bagong conference ng PVL. Uh, Siyempre, it's a different level run here in uh, Creamline kasi I'm playing with my mga veteran ako na teammates, hindi college players yung mga nakakalaro ko. So, ang dami ko rin natututunan sa kanila. Yung goal lang namin is to really come and go to the games prepared and sana makuha namin yung goal namin na maging masaya at syempre bonus na syempre sa amin yung manalo. Aside from Gia, isa pang tutulong pagdating sa leadership ay ang returning V-League at USD legend na si Ging Balse. Happy ako kasi syempre bumalik na naman ako dito. Kumbaga, once you valuable player, habang valuable player ka talaga, mamimiss mo eh, parang nahanap-hanap talaga ng katawan mo yun. Siguro andun yung 100% kong support ay bigay ko yung best ko sa team na to. Bagong friends, bagong family. And then, siguro hindi lang sa paglalaro yung bibigay ko as a leader, yung ganun. What we tell to our players lang is to keep up the good vibes every day. We were praying and we will work hard for, for us to have the chance uh, to be in the final for again, an opportunity to be in the finals. Dala-dala ang kanilang experience and learnings from last season, mas matibay at malakas na kupunan ng Cool Smashers ang siguradong lalaban ngayon sa PVL Open Conference. You know, Boom and Mosey, I'm sure that a lot of people, most especially Atenean fans, are really anticipating the Morado Valdez tandem once again. It's a souped-up lineup. Uh -huh. And we're going to talk It's not only her. Vargas, of course, and then uh, Jatsi King Balse, you know, all these. Uh, diba, uh, they're ready and prime uh, to go all the way. That's right. Kaya nga sabi ni Eliza, diba, gusto lang nila maging happy. Pero dun sa dinagdag nila, tingin ko mas yung bonus yung focus nila, diba? Tama, tama. To be a better team. This is going to be exciting. And alam natin lahat ng mga fans ng uh, Cool Smashers, uh, excited na rin na talagang makipag-usap sa atin, Janine. Tama ka dyan, Boom. Mga kapamilya, make sure you stay connected with us. Tweet us at ABS-CBN Sports and also use the hashtag PVL on ABS-CBN for your comments and insights on the match. Also, please check out exclusive photos on our Instagram account at ABS-CBN underscore sports. Make sure you keep up to date on all things about the Premier Volleyball League by checking out the number one Philippine sports website, sports.abs-cbn.com. Also, boom, dito sa V-League, meron tayong karagdagang feature kung saan binibigyan natin ang ating mga manonood ng first-person perspective ng mga kaganapan dito sa San Juan Arena. Yung mga fans natin na present Kahit masipag, kahit umuulan, dumayo dito sa San Juan Arena, meron silang oportunidad na makapagtanong sa kanilang mga idolo at ang kanilang idolo mismo ang sasagot sa katanungan na yun. And the best part about that is that they get to be featured on TV. Also, dahil mahal na mahal natin ating PVL fans, meron tayo isang bang karagdagang feature ang mobile photo booth kung saan pwede silang makisaya at pwede nilang makasama ang kanilang mga paboritong atleta. Saludo kami sa mga fans talaga ng volleyball at fans ng Premier Volleyball League. At uh, si Janine po ay Roronda. Roronda dito sa loob ng Piloil Flying D Center para makakalap ng mga balibalita at mga report para sa inyo maya, -maya po lamang. Kami naman ni Mosey, pag-uusapan yung dalawang team na to. Both are souped up with the Water Defenders and the Cool Smashers when we come back dito po sa SNA.
Ilang segundo na lang ay magsisimula na ang labanan ng Ghoul Smashers at ang Water Defenders dito po sa Philo and Fly the Center. And of course, kayo po ay nanonood ng live dito po sa SNA and sa PremierVolleyballLeague.com on live streaming. Boom Gonzalez muli kasama si Mozi Ravena, yung dalawang nagtunggali ang naglaman sa semifinals. Last year, three exciting games in the semifinals. Mozi, magkikita maaga dito sa ating open conference in day number three. Simulan natin ang ating uh, diskusyon sa water defenders. Obviously, a game short, a win short of a championship last year, but they were off to a good start uh, last weekend. Tama ka dyan, and boom, remember, a single round robin tayo. Oh. So pagdating sa eliminations, wala nang bawian. <laughs> hindi, hindi pwedeng bumawi, so kailangan... Napaka-importante nitong game na to between these two uh, teams, Water Defenders and uh, ang ating Cool Smashers. Look at our Water Defenders. Tama ka dyan. Napaka-ganda rin ang pinakita uh, last conference. Uh, very close fight against the Lady Warriors. Ito sila against the Power Smashers. Winning in all departments. Ang binigay lang talaga nila yung pagdating sa error eh. Mm. Very erroneous in that match. In, but still, in sets 2 and 3. Oh, oh, eh. Ang dami. Oh. Ang dami lang talaga. Pero in the end, tignan mo naman yung fifth set, 15-6. Talaga na mayagpag sila dun sa last set na yun. They really wanted this match and so they did. So, alam mo, they did win that. And Pati sa non-scoring skills, ha? Yes. Talagang uh, sila lahat ang nag-lead. So, it was really a good game for uh, the water defenders. Yeah, they were down dito sa ating labanan uh, uh, two sets to one. After starting off that set, uh, na napakaganda winning. Uh, pero in the next two sets, yun nga, error-filled sets. Pero yep. they recovered in the fourth set and then dominated in that fifth set. And of course, uh, this was the first game after the uh, the conference where our best setter was awarded that individual accolade after being converted in the uh -huh. UAAP as a best setter. Ay, as a setter, a naging best setter kagad. And boy, was she off to a great start here in the Open Conference. That's true, Boom. And, and in fact, yung, uh, yung na, tutulong no, ni Jasmine Nabor sa isang team comes from different uh, perspective, no? I mean, different skills. Like, pagdating sa service, may natutulog siya. Pag, obviously, setting, no? I, I, an impeccable setting job every time. 57 running sets. Can you just imagine in that match? May 8 points you siya know, sa game na yun. May palo. Theater, oh, right? May palo, may service. So, napakasarap kasama naman sa team. At siguradong napakaganda ng challenge niya sa harap niya ngayon dahil Yun nga, magkikita sila muli ng kanyang UAP rival. You can oh, say rival, uh, idol. idol ang saya! Uh, si Gia Murado. All right, let's get the thoughts of Jasmine Nabor. We had this conversation kasama si Janine Choi. Jasmine, paano kayo nakabawi from a 2-1 deficit kontra ang Power Smashers? Uh, Nag-less error po kami. Tapos napag-usapan po yung mga dapat gawin. Tapos nagkaroon po kami ng communication sa loob ng court. Paano mo naman nahasa yung skills mo from a spiker to a setter? Uh, every training po, nakikinig lang po kila coach. Tapos, nag-overload ako kung ano pa po yung mga kailangan ko improve as a setter. And, kinakosap ko yung mga spikers ko para mahasa ko po sila kung paano ibigay yung bola. Maraming salamat, Jasmine. Good luck sa inyo, mamaya. Balik sa inyo, Boom at Mozi. Maraming salamat, Janine. That's Jasmine Nabor, also the best player in that game where they won in five exciting sets. So, again, one of the things that we're going to look forward to is the rematch oh. niya at ni uh, Gia na di ba in-acknowledge niya in the UAP na talagang idol niya rin uh, coming into that season. So, speaking of Gia, who has now joined the Cool Smashers, pag-usapan natin sila. Sila galing sa panalo rin. Four sets over the new member of the PVL, the Adamson Lady Falcons, who really had a good showing in uh, Mosi had the uh, pleasure of doing that game. We were highly entertained by Adamson's grit and never say die attitude. Pero nang ibabaw ang talento at firepower nitong Cool Smashers. Well, uh, loaded eh. Ang uh, Cool Smashers. Loaded. Uh, Kukupira natin last conference. Ano? Mas loaded sila this conference. And, pero yung sabi nga natin, in that match, parehong panalo. Kasi natuwa Maganda. talaga ang crowd Maganda, ng fans natin sa Adamson. And as you can see the numbers here, fight na fight ang Adamson in that match. They had all uh, also 41 spike points. Ang Cool Smashers may uh, 8 more with 49. 
But tignan mo yung numbers, dikit lang pagdating sa blocking, pagdating sa service, and yung errors din, nandun lang sila, no? One just, uh, one more for the Adams and Falcons. Mm -hmm. Pero kung ikukumpira mo yan sa loaded right. na Cool Smashers, ngayon ang Cool Smashers naman na dahil loaded sila, I think, Gagaling at gagaling to every game because nagjejel eh, right. de ba? Sure, nangangapa pa yun sa simula, but I really think they will become a better team. Pagka each in every game, pagiging better team sa na. And that is the intention. Ang ganda ni sinabi ni Mozi, you know, it was a victory for both teams. One was an official victory, the other one was a moral Aww. victory. The Cool Smashers, of course, as we said, loaded, souped up. Ang kinaganda ng laro na yon against Adamson University at nabangkit namin ni Mozi dun sa laro na yon. Si Alay sa Valdez, eh medyo kumambyo lang ng mga unang Aww. dalawang set dahil binibigyan niya ng pagkakataon yung mga bago niyang mga teammates to really shine. And shine they did. Especially this former Lady Tamarao and this former Lady Warrior who is welcomed uh, with open arms dito sa Cool Smashers with that cool and powerful debut. Siya nga kagad, ang ating best player. Eh. Tama ka, Jen. <laughs> Boom. And then, napakaganda talaga yun. Welcome treat for uh, yung ating Cool Smashers. And obviously, sabi mo nga, nabanggit mo kay Aliza Valdez. Kasi towards the end, kumbaga may, may, ano pa, may energy pa si Aliza. Kaya, oo, oh, alam na alam niya kung kailan niya apakan yung gas. And uh, eto nga yung nangyari doon. Rosemary Vargas, throughout the match, talagang very consistent. Had 18 points in that match at malaki ang naitulong talaga oh. dun sa team. Kumbaga, sinet up ni Aliza yung kanyang oh. teammates to really excel in that right. game. And then in the fourth set, Duna, it was Eliza Valdez time. But the best player in that match was Rosemary Vargas, who also had a conversation with our very own Janine Joy. Pakinggan natin to. Rose, pag-usapan natin, kamusta ba yung first game mo sa Cool Smashers? Uh, it was fun and exciting na kasama ko na ulit yung dating teammates ko from DLC. Okay. So, paano mo naman mapapanatili yung level of production mo sa susunod din yung mga laro? Uh, yun lang, kailangan magtuloy-tuloy lang kung ano yung, yung nilalaro ko nung first game and sana hanggang at the end of the game, ganun pa rin. Maraming salamat Rose, good luck sa inyo mamaya, balik sa inyo, boom at mozi. So ngayon, kung ngayon lang kayo manonood ng PBL at ngayon nyo lang makikita ang Cool Smashers, Eliza Valdez, of course, the headliner of this team, now has a setter she can rely on, obviously, and somebody she knows, and she has a power hitter like Rose Vargas na talagang uh, susuporta sa kanya sa mga matitinding laro dito sa PBL, Mozi. Oo, oh, hindi lang yun, ano? Nakita ko, tumibay rin ng depensa nila with Dunag, di ba? Tama, and, that's oh, right. Oh. So alam nila, uh, bibigat pa yung mga laro dito sa ating Open co Conference. So, uh, mga, mga ngailangan talaga ng tulong si Eliza Valdez and she did get that help in that first game. Okay, sisimula natin laro between the Water Defenders and the Cool Smashers. So, samahan niyo po kami. Mag-trend tayo uli. Lagi na lang tayo nag-trend. Nag-number one pa tayo uh, for a few games uh, consistently dito sa PVL. So, you know the hashtag. It's PVL on ABS-CBN on Twitter at ABS-CBN Sports. Of course, wag nyo kalimutan ang IG natin, ABS-CBN uh, Sports uh, or ABS-CBN underscore sports, right, uh, uh, sports rather on Instagram. And of course, ang ating Premier Volleyball League.com and sports.abs-cbn.com slash livestream slash PVL. <sighs> Si DJ. Ready ka na? Si of course, DJ. ready na rin si DJ Tronics who's always in the Phil Oil Flying B Center ready to entertain our audience who have really come out to support the Water Defenders and the Cool Smashers who will play against each other in the second game of our Wednesday doubleheader sa ating pagpabalik dito sa SMA. Presenting our officials for this match. First referee, Mr. Nestor Bellio, international referee. Second referee, Mr. Yul Benosa, national referee. Before we meet the starters for both teams, And now, let's meet the starting six from the Ballet Pure Purist Water Defenders. Let's start off with the team captain, last season's best setter, jersey number four, Jasmine Nabor. 
Number five, last season's second best outside spiker, Gretchel Sultanes. Number nine, Aiko Sweet Ordas. Jersey number 10, Macy Mendiola. Number 11, best middle spiker from last season, Risa Sato. And number 15, Jerry Lee Malabanan. With starring libero, jersey number 6, Leslie Ann Pantone. And head coach, Mr. Roger Gurea. And now, let's meet the starters from Creamline Cool Smashers. Let's start off with the team captain. Best outside spiker and conference MVP, Eliza Valdez. Jersey number 7, Ivy Remulia. Number 10, Maria Paulina Soriano. Jersey number 12, Julia Melissa Morado. Number 16, Riza Mandapat. And number 17, Rosemary Vargas. It's starring libero, number 9, Angela Nunag. And head coach, Mr. Tai Bundit. It's match number 6 of the preliminaries, the Duck to both teams. Multi-awarded players also here in uh, our match dito sa ating second game ng ating Wednesday doubleheader. Sa loob po ng ating Philoi Flying V-Setter. Eliza Valdez, of course, best outside spiker. MVP, Gretzel, second best outside spiker. Alam naman natin, MVP rin yan sa NCA. And Sato, of course, uh, um, you know, coming of age when it comes to her volleyball, the best middle blocker and uh, Jasmine Nabor. Hindi ka ba tatapos dyan? Ang dami talagang magalik. Ang dami. And then you have icons and legends uh, in their own positions. Singing Balse, uh, coming off the bench. And you have Pantone, or back then, Gata. Right. These are, uh, yeah, ito yung mga iniidolo talaga ng mga current players. So, this excite, this is proving to be, or will prove to be, a very exciting match and an offensive match. Yes, Bosia. I would think so too. And uh, magiging importante dito siguro yung depensa, no? Dahil nga dyan sa malalakas na opensa nila. So let's see, we'll get a better first ball. Sa magiging lamang talaga. Ito pa, Mozi, banggitin ko. In the last game uh, that I covered on Sunday, I was so happy to see Aiko Sweet Ordas almost in pre-injury form. Oh, wow. Yan naman. Alam mo, di ba, tayo, tayong dalawa kasi we so believe in her. Yes. Na iniintay natin na bumalik yung strength niya, no? Yung uh, strength, power. Spirit, oh, energy. Oh. 15 points oh, nice. okay. in the last match. Oh, and nice. It's not just the points. Yung pag nakita mo paano niya ginawa yung points, oh. yung ano yung gana nung laro, uh, it was like the oh. old of that. Oh. Para may dominance, oh. di ba? Tapos yung... Uh, Kumbagay, sa kabila, may fear factor. Pag-itako kay Aiko na kayo. Correct. Oh. So, imagine yung mga match-up natin, Pao Soriano sa gitna. Sato oh. sa gitna. And then you have Nabor and Morado. And then you have Valdez and Soltones, Urdas Ay! and Vargas. Huwag na tayo magsalita. Ay, Manood na lang tayo. <laughs> Pwede. <laughs> Sobra yung mga yung match-up. Yun yung sinasabi ko kanina, no? Nung nakita na lahat ng teams na naglaro, na-excite ka eh. Yeah, yes. Sa mga match-ups na parating or nangyari. Sarap eh. Ito rin, playing really, Yun, really well. Yun, I was gonna say, there's mga up-and-coming superstars na alam mo talagang uh, maganda rin ang ipinapakita. At I'm sure, meron pang ipapakita. Ganda ng play para kay Pao Soriano. At 3-1 uh, for the Cool Smashers. Balikan natin si Janine Choi. Bumat muzi ka makailan lamang ay nagdiwang si Eliza Valdez ng kanyang 24th birthday. Para kay Eliza, ito sa day filled with love and surprises. Sinurpresa siya ng kanyang mama, papa at mga kapatid sa kanyang kondo kung saan ang nanay pa niya mismo ang nagluto ng kanyang paboritong adobo at pinagoongan. Sa kanyang birthday sa Lubong naman, sinurpress din siya ng kanyang kasintahang si Kiefer Ravenna kung saan may live na banda at catering pang inhanda si Kiefer. Inibita rin daw ni Kiefer ang mga taong malapit at, at espesyal sa buhay ni Ali nung gabing yon. Nagpainting rin si Eliza kasama ang kanyang manager at pabiru niyang sinabi na nadiscovery niya daw na may bago siyang talent maliban sa volleyball. May talent rin daw siya sa pagpainting. Balik sa inyo, Boom at Mozi. Nakita ko yun. Oh, oh, yung may yun painting niya, nila pa, sabi oh. niya na parang dream destination niya. Yung, yung Paris. One? Is that the one? Oh, no, oh, oh. Is that Gusto the niya talaga bumalik doon. Yeah. Oh. Ayan, and on cue, he gets the point. And by the way, why do our fans, our, our panel at large, who are very good, uh, very capable, 
Why do they always have to mention food at this time? <laughs> Why are you so heartless and cruel? May catering ka pag ni may catering ka pag nananaman siya. Nagugutong kami, pinagongan, adobo, eh, mag-aalas siya, tinap. Batiin natin na itong mga kapamilyang nanonood at nag-aapunan habang nanonood ng premiere. Well, sinisimplihan na tayo ni Jenny. Torture talaga, tinatorture na tayo dalawa. I tell you, that's not going to be the last time we're going to hear food <laughs> today. Oh. Des cross court opposite side, 5 3 cool smashers in the lead. Parang maaga pa nagsisimula si Eliza dito sa match na to. Well, I guess, alam din yung sen may sense of urgency on their part, dan alam din na tahirapan sila dito sa match. Service error for the birthday girl last uh, weekend. Coach Tai, oh, wala na yung bandana. Kanina nakabandana siya eh. Kaya nga eh. <laughs> it was a good look actually. Walang water defenders once again. Sabi nga ni Coach Roger, happy naman siya, no? In uh, how they ended. Pero alam mo eh, si Coach Roger, alam mong babalik stronger. Kasi nakita niya eh, ah, kaya mag-finals, no? So what's next? Tama. Diba? And, you know, you talk about Gretchen, obviously she has her own frustrations pagdating sa ganyan. Gusto niya talaga makakuha ng kampionato as... Remulla gets a point for the Cool Smashers, 6-4. to four. That kill block. That's right, solid block. She goes to the service deck. That's an icon. That's it. The Remulla, really. Oh. The sisters. We're a lot of here, the volleyball names in the families, the Palse. No question. There are a lot of them. Mga paglinawans, mga ulapnans. Mga ulapnans, tama. 7-4. Oh, nice. The ball opens up to Malabanan. Morado, sinilip. Soriano, but Pantone was there. Sa likod, binigay kay Soltones. Ah! Nobody. Morado getting the first ball and nobody wanted to get the second ball. Well, si Eliza gumalaw kasi siya, you know, going towards that ball. Eh, minsan ganyan talaga eh. Pag gumalaw sa volleyball, parang kumbaga may commitment ka na to get that ball. Macy Mendiola, server. 7-5. Vargas. Tipping it over, ganun din, ginawa ni Sato, balik sa Cool Smashers. Underhand set, Vargas na naman. Sato, the vastly improved middle hitter and blocker. Urdas, one to play. Lunag, misreading. Yes, so maobra eh, no? Yung position ni Lunag. And the border. She knew na walang tao doon. Alam mo, yun ang maganda kay Nabor. Sumisilip eh. Parehos lang. Sumisilip sa kapitbahay. I mean, I said this the last game as Valdez spikes this to the net. And wala naman tayong duda na Jasmine parang may abilidad talaga eh na matalino. She has such great volleyball IQ. Ang... Ang mas impressive sa akin, Mosi, is yung bilis nung kanyang yeah. pag-pick up nung feeling setting. Ko nga, feeling ko pinanganak talaga siyang setter, setter talaga. late sa na-discover. Because yung, yung Ganun, ability niya, tsaka yung skill siya, hindi cut out for a good setter. Hindi lang basta-basta eh. Kasi kaya siya mabilis. Kasi parang uh, yung moves niya, natural yung decision eh. making natural niya. Natural na natural. Yeah. Sato finds the corner. Down three earlier, the water defenders. Four straight points para sa kanila. Sila naman ang lamang. Eight to seven. Nagbabalik po tayo dito po sa Phil Oil Flying V Center para sa pagpapatuloy na ating live and exclusive coverage ng inyong paboritong Premier Volleyball League Open conference on this Wednesday evening. <laughs> the kids are out on a Wednesday evening. Dabbing inside. How about the water defenders? Ang ganda ng simula, Mozi ng Cool Smashers. Ha? Abante 7-4. to four. And then huwapo ng water defenders with four straight points to take over during the technical time. Kasi, you know, like yung uh, water defenders, ang laki, even if they did win the championship, Ang laki ng naitulog nun, character-wise sa kanila, for sure. So, they will 
find themselves in a better position. I think this conference to parang kasi mas solid na sila at may championship experience, de ba? Nandun na lahat yon, no? At sa katunayan, yun yung una, yun ang sinabi namin kung paano sila na nalo ng last game. They were down two one. They were playing so badly. Error, error wise, and then all of a sudden, you know, you score in Dulo, 56. Oh. Parang, yeah, kanina nakalimutan ko nga sabihin, it was really a character game for uh, was, the, yeah. the water defenders, yung last game nila, right, because, right. yun eh, yung, yung, yung steadiness ng Don, na hindi mo nakita na rata. Kumalma, kumalma lang. Hagang Dulo. So, magod din, finally, in Queen's Nationals, courtesy of Paolo Soriano. That, that was a really nice quick yeah. hit. Sa likod, Valdez sa gitna. Sato couldn't do anything. She was there, but uh, that was a bounce. Could have been, could have been teammates before. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Remember? Oh, oh. Could have been. Sabi nga natin, pag-isaban natin yun, may kanya-kanya talagang bahay. Kanya-kanya bahay. Oh. Journey. And Sato's journey is here in the PVL. Gumaganda ng gumaganda. That's right. It's, her the game has just gone up a level. And then, just one girl na nakikita natin na hindi naman kailangan laging matangkat yung middle hitters. Basta maganda timing mo sa bola. Masipag Pwede eh. effective kang yun. Masipag, maganda timing, magiging uh, magaling ka na middle blocker. Sabi ko nga kay Noreen on Sunday, kaya rin she improved so much in the UAP and then obviously in the last reinforced conference. Kaya nakita mo when the UAP ended, she was the most emotional of all. She was the one who was balling. Talagang umiyak ng todo-todo. As Nabor, a great serve. Soriano has been on point dito sa ating unang set. At yan ang inaasahan natin dito sa dalawang kupunan na to. Sa agutan, 10-all. And Pao Soriano with that angle. Ganda. May hindi na sa lap ni Urtas eh, di ba? How good would you feel if you're Pao Soriano kasama mo Valdez, may Vargas, may Morado? Di ba pinagbibintangan na nga natin siya last game na sila ni Gia? Magkakapi talaga sila. <laughs> <laughs> hindi sila magkaibang skwela. Naging magkakapi sila eh. Ito na rally natin dito at bumalik ang bola. Ito na yung depensa nga pinag-uusapan natin kanina. O sino siguro yung mga maganda depensa? Dahil grabe ang opensa, Boob. So, dyan pa lang sa net. Yung defense, kailangan nandiyan na present na. Rose Vargas. Always with that thud in her serve. Mababa. I think more than anything else, case uh, Icor does, and sana hindi natin abate, ano, because she is coming from a really great game. Mentally, she seems to have recovered from, you see, going fear of yeah, the injury. Yeah, you injured me. It's really getting back to her. The game. Oh, pressure yeah. of the UAP. Totoo. Parang relax siya nung last game. Eh. Relax na relax lang siya. She was having so much fun. Malabanan. Down the line, a little wide. Timeout, Valkyrie. 13-10, the Cool Smashers regain the lead and get it up to three. Timeout muna tayo, makinig tayo. Pagpunta lang dun sa open. Kailangan natin makalisip. Sige, pagka may chance, sigit na tayo. Eh mga outside hitter, haluin nyo ng todo yung bola. Huwag nyo ilalagay lang, tapos ayaw ko. Bisyong-bisyong mo yan, pagpapunta doon, pinakalawit mo, laging nag-over. Kunin mo sa task, pwede naman pag ganun. Palis, pagpunta ko, Roscord, bakit kailangan mong hawiin eh? Bababa yung sikon mo. Ha? O, oh, sige, sige. Bill Cortez, of course. And the, the water defender. The lovely Rhea Navarro. There you go. From Sports Vision. We're going to visit it because it's really in Qatar. Based. It's good to see them again. And they're watching a perfect game. Because it's so good here today, 1310. Sato making the adjustment. Valdez. Oh! Puts it away. He gives a little bit of space to the blockers on the other side. Let's take a look at this once again. Hindi pantay si Ordas at siya kasi sa ato dun sa pagkakablock. So Valdez was able to get that. 
14-10. Cool smashers naman ang may sunod-sunod na puntos dito. Down 7-8. And all of a sudden, it is an 8-2 run. Para dito sa kubo na ni Coach Tai. At papasok na si Jarell Singh para kay Jerry Malabana. Ano yung uh, pinag-uusapan natin yung malalakas humampas? Yan, dalawang yan. Singh, di ba? Yes, Malabana. Natural power. Oh. You're right, you're right. <laughs> Speaking of. Oh. That's always been her thing. Kahit yung palit. Yung serve, ang service error niya. Rarely magnet, usually pala. Hindi, hindi pa talaga. Kasi ang lakas niya, ang lakas ng palo. Sing with a good serve. Valdez, naunahan ang blocker sa pagtalon. And Pantone couldn't handle it. 16-11, yes. The perfect angle. And a perfect set mula kay Gia. Good Vibes Freeze Moment is brought to you by Creamline. Magpa Good Vibes, mag Creamline, creamy ice cream. 16-11 is our score. And uh, from down 7-8. Uh, lamang ng lima, itong uh, cool smashers na nagahanap po ng kanilang pangalawang panalo dito sa ating open conference of our premier Volleyball League. Patuloy po kayong mag-tweet sa amin at ABS-CBN Sports. Huwag niyong kalimutan ang hashtag natin, PVL on ABS-CBN. And of course, ang ating mga masisipag na uh, humahawak ng ating mga uh, social media like our Instagram. Eh, patuloy na magpapadala ng mga picture, mga post ng pictures mula dito sa scene sa Phil Oil Flying V Center. Sundan nyo lang po ang IG at ABS-CBN underscore sports. And of course, Mozi, batin natin ang magandang gabi. Lahat ng mga kapamilang nanonood sa PremierValleyballLeague.com and sa sports.abs-cbn.com slash livestream slash PVL. Katulad nila Grace Garcia. Dream line versus Tally Pure. Parado against Tabor. Yan ang nga yung sinasabi natin. Uh -huh. Makaka-excite makita ang amazing place and battle of wits nila. Possibly, finals contenders. Pwede na makaan. Pinoy Jacks, hatawan na. Pantes and Tones. Yung mga match-up, di ba? Setter si Setter. Oh, iconic. Ang headband ni Coach Tai. Tinanggal nga sa mga ngaling load natin. So, Sogon City Bicol, Cecil Desit. Magandang gabi sa inyo lahat. Maraming salamat. Oo, salamat sa panunood. At even sa Boracay, pinapanood daw tayo sila Coach Claude. Dahil si Shekina and Alia. Ah, ganun? San Diego, Mark Torres. Pinapanood rin tayo. Ingit pa kayo. Oo, nga eh. Salamat, salamat. Thank you, thank Tutok you lang. Senior. Don't forget the hashtag. Let's 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 let the BVL go number one again. BVL on ABS CBN. Remulia on the runner. Chance ball para sa Cool Smashers. I think that's the Morado. One two play. Singh was there. Soltones get one paran. Hinabul na naman ni Morado. Balik kay Valdez. And too acute para dun sa angulo. It's right, one thing to go for a cut shot, pero hindi nangyari. So, oh, so far, itong uh, water defenders, seven attack points na. Pero, partner ng Cool Smashers, 11 na. Tapos uh, may dalawang block points pa sila. May isang uh, ace pa. 18-13. So, maaga kasing... Uh, Bumulaga itong si Eliza Valdez, di ba? First, ibang-iba dun sa nakita natin. Dun sa last game. Oo, last game. Kasi siyempre dahil first game ng mga iba. Sige, bagat, ano mo na, masanay muna kayo. Speaking of angles, Soltones, also going for one. Goes to Ballot Pure. 14, serving 18. Soltones. Always the happy girl. Ay, nako. Di ba? Always smiling. Sila nga ni Sato eh. Lagi oh, silang ganun eh. Pwede sa happy, happy team ni Coach Taito eh. So, <laughs> nasa, and it rubs off to their teammates. Really does. True. Oh, Marado? Kailangan, kailangan mo ba-smile nila si Aiko Ordaz, di ba? <laughs> <laughs> and she was nung oh. first game. As in, pansin na pansin. Ganda <laughs> nung play. That's right. Look at that. 
Nahugot si Ripuya. Lapat with the points para sa Valdez. Napamewag si Coach Tai. Tsaka tingnan ba yung tingin ni Coach Tai? Titig na katitig kay Aliza. Ayan na, ayan na. Nagtaon kung nawakan niya. Valdez receiving. Dapat is check, return to center. Pumahapo ng water defenders. Tatlo na lamang ang abante. Actually, ang ganda na ng decision ni Gia to give it good sa opposite side. Pero mas maganda pa ang pag-abang sa water defenders dahil na-block nila yun. Alam mo, Mosey, maganda itong barometer ng team sa isa't isa. Diba? Parang they can measure themselves against each other and see where they are in this tournament. And uh, you know, you only get one chance. The battle single round dropping oh, like that. So it's really more of uh, scouting. Mm -hmm. Kung oh, kayo, diba? na, sa oh, next phase sa na. Na, so. Kaya ang gandang, ano nito, sukatan. Tsaka yung, ano, yung quick adjustment uh -huh. inside, di ba? Kung sukati mo to, hindi pwede next game, then wala na next game. So, kung, uh, kung ano, next uh, series na oh. ever. Speaking of sukat, sukat na sukat yung palo. Yung Eliza Valdez, sukat na sukat ng mga blocker. Yung palo ni Jorel Singh, umabante na ng lima. Ang cool smashers at 21 to 16. Ang lalataan nyo dun sa lobby, ang lulungkot ninyo. Ay, namatayan ng pusa eh. Tahimik na tahimik kayo dun sa loob. Anong gagawin natin? Pasugod na tayo eh. Tatlo na lang yung lamang nila. Pagkatapos, parang wala lang sa inyo. Hindi pwede kaya. Maglalaro tayo. Masigla tayo. Kasi yung karakter niya yan, yung inaayos niya, yung confidence niyo. Hindi pag tahimik kayo, madali kayong iba eh. Ha? Tapos nyo, mahaba ka nandun. Nabaan mo yung palo mo? Eh, doon lang dumadaan doon sa main net. Eh, siyempre kahit 5-4 lang yung bablock dyan. Time out, Coach Roger. Dahil 4 points away ang Cool Smashers from taking set number 1. Very clear, no? Pag in-explain ni Coach Roger kung ano yung pagkakamali. Klaro-klaro. So, kung may pag-player ka, dapat maintindihan mo kagad pag balik mo dun sa court. Another block, but this one is out. Jarell Singh using her power there. Mangkaloy and JP Manahan. Maraming salamat sa inyong panunod. Yun, ganda ng palo ni Jarell Singh in direksyon palabas. Getting it off the block. Yung si Mendiola. Morado, reverse set. Pagkakataon para sa water defenders. Yun ang talagang kitang-kita mo. And it's no coincidence, Mosey, na yung improvement ni Sato this year in the UAP and in the Reinforced Conference coincides with Jasmine Nobor as the setter. I was going to say that. Naunahan mo ako. Alam mo, Boo, kasi hindi madali yun, yung last play, para iset kay Sato for a quick yes. At nagkakaamuyan sila ng maganda talaga. Full trust yan eh, Sobra. sa isa't isa na maiaabot sa akin ni Jasmine kahit malayo siya. Di ba, normally ang quick hit kasi magkalapit niya dalawang yan eh. Pero ito, malayo siya. Dapat si Sato, ito, trusted niya na may aabot sa kanya. So she will just go for her approach at itayin yung bola. But sometimes, and we, obviously we covered these games for a long time, Mosey, sometimes talaga a player's improvement is... It's not just on herself. It's on, so obviously, the co coach, combination lahat yan. But sometimes, pagka meron kang partner in crime na talagang may nagkaamuyan kayo, eh, madadamay ka. And, Kasama pa siya kung may matibay kang libero, di ba? So, siyempre. Uh, mas madali ang volleyball kung team ever siya. At Tony lang naman oh. yung libero nila. <laughs> Oo, oh, naman wala. <laughs> wala. Uy, lumusot pa. The tape of the net. Nakuha ni Vargas. That's how powerful her uh, hits are. Lamang kapag uh, malakas eh. Yan, katulad nito. Very powerful. In fact, off-speed na nga lang yung binigay. Pero tama yung ikot ng ball, ha? Trickle to the other side. I think that was also the reason why Jaja Santiago had her best year also, individually. Diba? As a player. Yep. Other than the fact na physically, she's just hitting her peak, diba? In oh. college. But Jasmine Nabor has a lot to do 
Kasi nagkikinig yeah, nga mas matibay yung back row ni Jaja. So, mm, diba? Oo. Oh, Nakakawan na rin siya ng Brutus doon. Diba yung uh, ano eh. Ano ba yung sinasabi nila talaga. sometimes? Yung, yung parang point guard din. Kailangan magandahin o pagwapuhin mo yung mga teammates. Of course. Ang ganun trabaho ng mga katulad ni Nila Gia Morado at Jasmine Amor. Si Morado ay eh, medyo angat dito sa ating laban. Apat ang abante, 24 to 20. Cool smashers over the water defenders. We are at set point. And Pao Soriano. At the service deck. Ginapol ni Nabor. Maganda ang bigay pa rin. That's a great dig, by the way, by Soriano. That just set up. Eliza Vagdes, courtesy of, of course, a UAB best setter herself. At one point, Chiam Morado. Kabat. Pwede ba natin hatiin ang puntos si Bigay Kepao yung kalahate? Kapat, dapat lang. Kapat lang. We'll take a break. We'll be back with set number two. Dito po sa inyong PBL on ABS-CBN.